Hi, Hevra. Welcome back to the short vort. We want to dedicate this afternoon, or today's vort, to Avraham Shmuel ben Klonimus HaKohen. This is Rabbi Nuriel Klinger's father. His neshama shavn aliyah. He was a special man who loved Judaism and loved Torah. And in this respect, these words really will, uh, will be an elevation to his soul. Because there's an amazing pasuk in this week's parsha. It's the very beginning. God says, I'm going to give you a blessing and a curse, a bracha and a klala. And then it says, what's the bracha? Ed ha-bracha asher tishmeu el mitzvot Hashem alokechem. The blessing is that you listen to the commandments of God, you live a Jewish life, that which I command you today. And the Kedusha Slaver of Levi Yitzchuk Berdichev says, I, I don't understand. <laughs> what, what do you mean? Et abracha asher, that, what's the blessing, right? Is, shouldn't it be, right? You'll have rain, you'll have bounty, you'll have food, and you'll have wealth, and it'll be, you'll be prosperous. Why doesn't it say that? It should, it should say, et abracha im tishmu, oh, you'll get all these blessings if you listen. Says the Kedusha Slavi, and I'll read you his inimitable words, his beautiful words. He says, think about it for a moment. There really is char mitzvah b'hai al-maleka, they say. There really is no reward for a mitzvah in this world, right? A mitzvah is a spiritual thing. There's not really no reward. The mitzvah, the mitzvah is the ability to do another mitzvah. Schar mitzvah, mitzvah, right? So God will give us bounty and hopefully and blessings and wonderful physical things so that to help us, you know, keep going, to help us enhance our mitzvah observance, our, our Jewish way of, ways of life. But says the Kedusha Slevi something else. He says, Dein Sarchioter Sachar. He says, the mitzvah, the schar itself is the mitzvah gufa. Being able to do the mitzvah is schar enough, is reward enough, is privilege enough. You don't need anything else. Rakzeh gufa. Shezochela sos mitzvah. The reality is the just that we have the ability, the privilege to lead Jewish lives, to lead meaningful Jewish lives, to be part of a Jewish community, to and give our kids a Jewish education to be connected. The Asatanug Labore and to give delight to Akadish Baruch Hu, to know that we're serving God in the best way we can. Ain Lacha Sachar Yoter Mizeh. There is no greater reward than that. Mic drop. We live, my friends, in a world where we understand the great blessings that we have just as a result of being a part of a Jewish community, of living Jewish lives, meaningful Jewish lives, of living lives of Torah and mitzvot, dedicated to chesed and tzedakah. Think about what the world was like for someone who didn't have what we had over the past year and a half in COVID and a community and, and, and being connected and feeling connected. And even though you're apart, knowing there's things going on and there are people caring about you and worrying about you and thinking about you and that's what we have. We have a blessing in our midst. May we be zoche, may we be privileged to recognize those blessings every single day and may it enhance our observance and our connection to Torah, to mitzvot, to the Jewish community, to Am Yisrael and Eretz Yisrael. Have a great Shabbos and a Chodesh Tov.